there and welcome to my channel. My name is Andriana and this is my creative journey. It's been a while since I do any kind of haul videos and for this one I just wanted to show you because I was so excited when I saw this year uh, uh, creativation and uh, all the new things that uh, 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 manufacturers are doing and of course uh, some signature designers from Ranger. I just had to have these bags from Dina Wakely. I actually bought three sets. Uh, some are still on the way and I'm already using uh, <coughs> excuse me, first set <coughs> sorry and I just love it. I love her colors, her combination of colors, her ways of painting. I just love it. Okay? So I got to have more bags from Tina Wakely. Sorry, Tim Holt. Sorry, uh, Dan Rivley. You are not my uh, uh, go to when it comes to bags because I love colors. I don't know what's happening to me this year. So, the other things which I bought is this Creative Flip Journal, a small one. I actually plan to also buy the big one, but I just wanted to try this one first. Uh, it has less pages than the, the regular one, because this one has, uh, new one has 36 pages, and this one has 48 pages. So, they are similar, they are exact the same measurement but they are less pages. I also bought this creative journal because I'm halfway through through the, uh, the exact one so I just wanted to buy a refill not refill, <laughs> another journal and to the my new Dina Wakely Media Journal. I was so excited when this came because I just wanted to play immediately and I just thought, okay, I really need to show everybody this. This is... wow! Wow, wow, wow! <laughs> okay, then some stamps. Even though this is a, a, a Zinsky art, this has nothing to do with the arranger. This is actually paper art uh, uh, um, brand. And when I saw this, I knew I needed to have them. They are so funky. <laughs> and I know that I will play with them in my journal. Look at this bird. <laughs> okay, so I had this. Some st uh, stencils. I had some uh, stencils from Tim Holtz. This is the old one, I think, and this is also the old one, but this is the newer. Uh, this is uh, Grid Dot. So, that. This is also the old stencil from uh, um, Dan Rivley, uh, and I just wanted to play with those masks and stencils. Okay. <clears throat> this is also Paper Artsy. And I, from Kim Dello, I just love this style and I know that I'm going to use this in my art journal. And this new Dina Wakely stencil. And as you can see, those stars are here. So, I'm gonna mimic her a little bit. <laughs> okay. Her scribble sticks. I did not even open them yet. And I just... Oof! Can't wait, can't wait to play with them. Okay. Then I bought some Tim Holt Distress Crayons. This is set uh, 1, 2 and 3. Those are the first sets. I never had them before. So I decided to try them. Because I have now my Dina Wakely Media Journal. So I know that I'm going to play them, play with them inside. I also b bought this bundle Sage because this one is not in the set. So I know that later I will not remember to buy it. I also bought this Distress Crayon Storage Tin to put them inside, of course. Then I also did not have this. This is Distress Sprayer. So I just wanted to try this one because uh, this one sprays um, too wide. And uh, actually it's not um, concentrated on, on one area. It just, it's just... it's not okay for me. So I will try this one. Then I bought Uniball, okay, this is something that I already used, so this is just a 
something to have extra. And I actually bought, this is from American Crafts, uh, chalk markers, because I have uh, Diane Rivley's uh, journal, the black one, and I just wanted to try this one. Maybe this one, this, these are going to paint better. Because when you paint with this, those, it smudges if you go with the hand, if it's not, I don't know what's happening, but they are not okay. And, of course, I had to buy myself paint paints from the Illusions, so I just bought uh, this uh, black and white and, of course, colors. I did not even notice these ones. Uh, uh, um, actually, I wasn't uh, really sure if I saw everything from cre cre um, CAJ from the last year, so this was issued before. Uh, then, one dye ink pad from Ranger, reinker, some more reinkers from, this is Picked Raspberry. I'm actually have, I think I have 10 more left to buy, so I will have all of them. Then, some Dina Weekly paints. Uh, I did not buy everything, but I just wanted to, because I have uh, it already uh, in a tube, so I just wanted to try this one because she says that you could paint with them, you know, make some kind of marks. So about tangerine, uh, fuchsia, ocean, uh, blackberry, lemon, and night. And I also bought some paper artsy paints. These are, um, not all of them are new because uh, this is just to refill something that I, I have noticed that I did not have. Uh, so I bought Claret, Cherry Red, Dusty Teal and Zesty Zang and only this Dusty Teal is opaque, the three of them three of those are actually translucent. Ex uh, excellent for layering. And, sorry, and banana, which is also translucent. And I bought this set after limited edition paints. Uh, it has smoked papri papri paprika, green patina, mud splat and key lime. So, and of course I got this new colors because the old ones which I had are actually too old <laughs> now because some of them are not even um, available no so this is it this is my haul I can't wait to start playing with them and I'm going to say goodbye bye